so first things first. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to measure each side of the ladder to 84 inches. And then we're going to go outside to our miter saw and we are going to cut exactly where we measured out that 84 inches. Okay, so after we've cut our two pieces into the 84 inches, we're going to come back inside and use our third piece of wood and we're going to cut it into 18, 17, 16, 15, and 14 inch cuts. And by doing this, that's how you're going to get that angular look with your ladder and not just a straight look with your ladder. So what I'm doing here is I'm simply just marking out where I'm going to cut each piece at and these are eight feet pieces so we're gonna have more than enough wood um, to mark each piece and I actually made sure that I went like a tenth over so that when I do cut it down it's gonna be the exact size that it needs to be okay so now we're gonna go back out to our miter saw and this time we're gonna turn our miter saw to a four degree angle and that's why I went over a tenth of an inch on each piece so that when I cut it it's going to be the exact um, inch that it needs to be. So this is what it looks like after you have cut down that one piece of wood into the different inches that they're supposed to be. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take our side pieces and I'm going to line them up. And then I'm going to go and take our 18 piece inch wood and I'm going to use my ruler. You're going to go up 18 inches on to the side pieces and that's where you're going to place your first um, rail for your ladder. So then after you've placed that first um, piece in, you're going to go up 12 inches and the remainder of the pieces of wood that you have for your rail, you're just going to go up in 12 inch increments. And that's it. You're just going to make sure that um, the angles are right. So when you push them together, the ladder should get smaller and smaller as you go up um, on each rail. All right, so after I did like a practice run, I'm gonna come back and use my clamps and I'm gonna clamp the wood together to make sure that I'm getting these angles right so that they're gonna be, so that they're positioned correctly for when I nail them together. So in this next clip, I'm just gonna be using my leveler and the clamps and I'm going to be putting them at the 12 inch increments, making sure it's straight so that we can come with our nail gun and shoot them into place so they're nice and sturdy. And we're gonna to continue to do this up the ladder. Okay, our next step is we're going to sand the ladder and then we're going to stain it with dark walnut and then seal it with polyurethane and satin. Okay, so we're all finished and this is the finished product. We did two ladders for under $10. This was literally $8 for both of these ladders. Uh, this was a quick, simple DIY project. So um, honestly, I would definitely recommend doing this, guys, um, especially if you have the tools. Even if you don't even have a nail gun, you can um, use just like your drill and drill some wood screws in there. Um, so it will save you some bucks because some of these ladders run for $75, $50. Um, I love how this turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY. Make sure you subscribe, you like, and thank you guys for watching. Oh.